Hello everyone. In today's screencast, we'll see how to install WordPress securely on your local machine. In this screencast, security is given more importance and we'll see how to do it now. Let us start a secure installation by opening WAMP server. I'm starting, I'm gonna click on WAMP server. Yes. And I'm going to click on the WAMP server icon and then I'm going to put put online and then I'm going to click on the WAMP server icon again and I'm going to open my PHP admin here I'm going to click on databases and then I'm going to create a new bit database I'm going to give it an obscure name like bang my head and then I'll click create now my database is created now to install my WordPress I'm using WordPress 3.3.1 it's on my that zip file is on my desktop double click on it and then extract this folder to your desktop just wait till the extraction gets finished extraction is finished this. now rename this folder I'm going to rename this folder as bang my head with a huge brick my folder is called bang my head with a huge brick it's a crazy name and now just cut this folder and then move to your local disk C WAMP www wordpress just going to create a new folder um, I actually run multiple instances for instances of WordPress so I need to create more folders so I'm going to call it as theme tester 2 I'm going to paste my folder a couple of pointers since I'm actually running a, a huge number of WordPress sites so I'm I've navigated into deep into my www directory but if you are using or doing a fresh install or something like that www is your root so you can directly put this particular folder that is bang my head with a huge brick into your www folder that is, that is you can directly put the uh, bang my head with a huge brick folder into this www folder assuming that we have done that now i'm going to my folder bang my head with a huge brick go into it and then click on index dot pf first of all we just have to uh, rename our wp dash config dash sample I'm going to click on rename I'm just going to remove the dash sample good I'm going to edit this in my text editor yeah that, uh, my text editor is sublime text 2 by the way uh, your database name is bang my head username is root password is nothing control s close it and then yeah now what you have to do is copy it's not move but copy your index.php control c into this theme tester 2 folder that is in my theme tester 2 folder I have my uh, another folder which is bang my head with a huge brick and this particular folder will have all my PHP documents except I have uh, what I'm doing is I have copied my index.php here into my theme tester folder that is one folder above the bang my head with a huge brick folder I did this in your text editor and go to require part and then you have to direct this particular link to your uh, installation folder that is bang my head with a huge brick so I'll put a forward slash bang my head with a huge brick slash and that's it I think you just have to worry about this much close it and then I guess 
everything is done we'll just test our installation once I'll open a new window and then local host slash word press slash theme tester 2 if you have to install you have to go to your crazy folder remember for installing you have to go to your crazy folder name okay that is bang my head with a huge brick now you can install your wordpress i'll just put some theme tester 2 my initials password is i'm just using a weak password for now now i'll click install wordpress it's going to take some time and yes my wordpress got installed i'm going to log in and then my initials my small password have successfully logged into my new uh, wordpress installation there are a couple of settings to be made go to settings go to general and then my wordpress address is theme tester 2 this is my crazy uh, this is supposed to be the same thing that is theme tester 2 bang my head with a huge brick this should be the same but my site address should be theme tester 2 if you are using doing a fresh install and you are not having multiple instances of wordpress running if you just click on http dash colon forward slash forward slash localhost slash word slash your crazy folder name will come here that is uh, you won't be having this wordpress and theme tester tool like if you are doing a fresh install and your slide url will be just http colon forward slash forward slash localhost that's it i mean your site address should be where you have copied your index.php file the new file resides that particular folder should be your site address while your wordpress address should be the folder in which all your wordpress files reside um yeah let's test whether our site is working or not go to lo local host slash wordpress slash theme tester 2 and, and here is my newly secured installed local wordpress thanks for watching see you next time